Well, hello there. Welcome to the October edition for your monthly dose of slams. I'm your host. Well, I think you should know by now. Now I have good news and I have bad news. I'm gonna start with the bad news. The bad news is, is obvious. Spooky season's over. It's fucking sad. But the good news is for you guys on this channel and in my presence, it's always fucking Halloween, bitch. That and we also got some fucking slams to showcase. My fucking phone just fell. There goes all the bands. All right, enough foolishness. Now let's get some chaos out of the way with this four-way sample slam and split by gangrenous flesh consumption, gore pot, miramasa, and unrelenting butcher. That is a whole fucking foursome right there. If you guys haven't checked this one out already, it is a highly must because what what the fuck are you doing? You add it to your playlist already. Oofies, for this next release right here, we got fucking Corpse Maggot Crew and they gave us their EP, Family Vacation. Are you guys ready for some more fucking sample slams? I agree, Kimba. Go ahead and help that poor little pussy. <laughs> And I shit you not, these, these are some dink fucking slams. From beginning to end, I fucking highly recommend this shit. All is calm, all is Oh, next one, you guys. Exhumanator gave us 10 slamming tracks on this fucking release. Oh my fucking goodness. The production is fucking great, man. Those kicks are literally backing those fucking guitars up and it's giving it a fucking impact. This next release is if you want straight up no blue balling slam, you want fucking straight to the fucking point chugs. The name says it all, we have Toiletectomy giving us their album Engorged Through Tragedy. And holy fuckness, you will not be disappointed. I go to McDonald's and get a big bitch because you a bitch. Bitch. All right, get ready to feast on some excruciating gravy slams because we have Gore Grave giving us 10 brutal bashing tracks with their album Pain. <laughs> All right, you guys, do not get mad at me because I myself make slamming beat down, and I'm only saying it's slamming beat down because it has slam elements, and don't get mad at me. Well, anyways, because Never Pray done stomp the shit out of us with this album, Hermeticon? Hermeticon. Hermed Icon. <laughs> Alright you guys strap up because in this next release we have some fuzzy slams from Backyard Cannibalism. And they done gave us their fucking 3 track EP, Undead Imprisonment. Alright, this next one is a fun one that I know you guys will fucking love. Here we have some Mexican Brutality Corrosive Vomit, and they're slamming the shit out of us with their really heavy ass album, Slamming the Streets Fight for Supremacy.
fellow snare lovers, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like stealing this fucking drummer's snare right here. And this next release, Vital Flesh gave us their single, Failure and Depravity, featuring Chris Blackwell. <laughs> Ooh, if this next one right here, you guys, Bashed In and State of Filth on the same fucking track, that's an automatic click for me. State of Filth gave us their single Endless Torment featuring Bashed In, and holy shit, I just want a whole fucking split from these guys. And this next release, Repulsive Humanity, gave us some disgusting gutturals and slams with their single, Purge the Grotesque Consequences of Humanity. <laughs> As this shit was not consequence and grotesque enough. Up next we have Grotesque Desecration with their single Irreversible Consequences. And you guys literally check this one out. It is fucking too good for fucking Slam Worldwide. <laughs> Alright, keeping horror alive from last month, we have Discuss the Bus, giving us a 5 track EP enough to make your blood shock. Talk about literal fucking sci-fi slams, this fucking release literally had me feel like I was in the 1950s silver era watching fucking aliens movies. It actually sounds kind of creepy too, it should be fucking labeled as like ghost slams or some shit. It's like something I'd be hearing when I'm the last kid at the arcade and it's closing time. This next one is genitals disassembled with their single a parasitic eye socket infestation. <laughs> Next up we have a 2023 promo from Septism and I know this one is fucking labeled as gore grind but if those chugs aren't giving you fucking slam vibes well then shit I'm the queen of New England's drug dealer. <laughs> Alright, we ain't going underground with this one, we're going under fucking world. Resurrected Divinity is back with their 4 track EP, Lycanthropy, and holy shit, it kicks werewolves in the fucking balls. <laughs> Alright, next up we have an 11 track album titled Upper Triassic Slam Cladicalism. Sorry, that was fucking hard to say all at once. From the dudes that fucking make death metal heads cry, Blastocystia. <laughs> If you guys haven't heard of these dudes yet, they are a must, must for your fucking playlist. Next up we have Rebirth Through Transformation by Venom Symbiote. I don't know if they're working on an album because these three tracks kind of just are by themselves. I don't know if it's just the EP right there and shit because they're all released as singles. Or they might just be teasing us with the album. Who fucking knows? But anyways, aside from that shit, grade fucking A. Especially the production wise too. Especially for fucking Slam. Alright, next up we have another dope ass fucking EP. We have Necrofeast in the Exhumed by Roots of Deception. <laughs> God 
damn it. Now we're gonna get blue balled by fucking Brutal Mind with these next few releases. They're singles and they're just teasing us for the fucking new albums and shit. And EP. I don't know about Visceral Explosion though. Visceral Explosion, what the fuck's going on? The fuck's going on, Ryu Gun? Are we gonna get a fucking album? I'm kidding, but I am excited though. Papa bless Brutal Mind for these next singles. Alright, first up, the fucking boys done did it again. Visceral Explosion gave us their fucking single, Gluttonous Barbaric Carnage. And boy, is it fucking brutal. Even the fucking name is brutal. Even the fucking label is brutal. Even the fucking name of the label is brutal. Alright, next up we have the single The Final Decomposition from Endless Outrage and they're teasing us with their new album In Heaven of Fear, releasing January 15th, 2024. <laughs> Alright, this last single from Brood of Mine is Slam Dozing Remnants of a Metaphene from Necrophilic Beatdown, a two-man cage slam duo, and this is off their upcoming EP that's also releasing on January 15th, 2024. Alright, and this last one isn't from Brutal Mind, but it is the fucking slamming legends that are up and coming from fucking 2012, Devour the Fetus. They're giving you their two-track EP, Ocean of Fetal Abomination. I highly recommend their discog, you guys. <laughs> Alright, and this wraps it up for this episode of Slams of the Month. I hope some of these were new to you guys and you enjoyed the brutality. And until next time, I gotta take a shit. Bye-bye and farewell.